Hey everyone, in this video I will show you how to fix Valorant stuck on map loading screen. So please follow the steps with me and let's get started. Ok, first of all, close down right games if it's open and make sure it's not running in the background. So to do that, just go to your task manager. And in here, check to see if Valorant and right game is running, close them. And next, disable any third party antivirus or Windows security on your computer. On your desktop, right click on Valorant and select properties. In here where it says run, click on normal window and choose minimized. Once you've done that, then click on compatibility and make sure to check this option, run this program as administrator. After that, click on apply and OK. The next solution is to change or check the DNS server in your computer. So to do that, open up run by pressing Windows key and R on your keyboard. And type in here ncpa.cpl and then just click OK. Over here, choose the internet connection that you're working on. So in my case, I'm working on Wi Fi. So I'm just going to right click on Wi Fi and select properties. And next, in here, select internet protocol version 4 and click on properties. Then we need to select this option, use the following DNS server address. And for preferred DNS server, type in there 8.8, 8.8. And then for the bottom one, which is alternative DNS server, type in there 8.8, 4.4. Also make sure to check this option, validate settings upon exit. Just in case you have already selected this option in the past and it still is not working, then you can just choose the top one, which says obtain DNS server address to my ugly, and just click OK. And next, close all this. Then restart your computer. After you restarted your computer, if you're still having an issue, then try the next step. Head over to your local disk C drive and look for Riot Games folder. Then open up Valorant and Live. Over here, make sure to delete debug files Win64. If this solution failed, then you can try the next one. Open up Command Prompt. So to do that, go to Search Bar and type in there CMD and make sure to run it as administrator. We need to type these two commands in the command prompt. These commands will be in the video description. The next one, copy and paste it in here. And once you're done, just restart your computer. Please remember, you must restart your computer before you move on to the next step. Otherwise, it won't work. After you restarted your computer, then go to local disk drive and program files. Look for right Vanguard folder. Once you find it, make sure to delete it. Then launch the right games and log into your account. Once you signed in, then you will see an update. So just go ahead and update it. Hopefully one of these solutions will work for you. So please don't forget to let me know in the comments below. And that's all. By the way, if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please consider supporting me and subscribing for more videos. Thanks for watching.